Really enjoyed Fraser. I was surprised how natural it was. Lots of trees, and nice swimming places, and just a really secluded, lovely place to go. A unique place, remote, only accessible by four-wheel drive. You can see rainforest on the island, which is pretty amazing. Fraser Island is, is a place that most people often want to come back to and find it really hard to leave. I've been lucky enough to be coming here since I was a little kid. I think what people find the most amazing about it is just the diversity here. Uh, some amazing lakes. Beautiful creeks. Eli Creek was cool. It was just so much fun floating down the stream. Just nice to, to get in the fresh water and be able to drink it as well. The Indian Head. I love the panoramic view up there and spotting and seeing how rich sea life was out there. And so nice, a real nice lookout. Big sand dunes, towering rainforests, so everything that uh, you can think of probably in Australia is on Fraser. I really like the champagne pools, they were cool. I uh, enjoyed uh, the beach driving, all the different variety of terrain there, a bit of driving fast along the beach and then going through the water and stuff, that was new for me and seeing all the, seeing all the wildlife along there. And just the whole camping experience, I thought we did it really nicely, just camping the whole time. I thought it was great being owner-operated. Mark is still really passionate about the service he's offering you. He made sure you understood the history of the island. A personal touch meeting some of his older family as well. You felt you got a real sense for Fraser Island. and More intimate really, rather than being on a huge tour group. And he's so organised and, and friendly and it just makes the whole thing just a bit more special. I like to be a small independent company and it's all about people, not numbers.